and thanks for joining us at EMII.com. I'm Kathleen Reddington with your Capital Markets Report. Today is Thursday, July 31st, 2008. According to Bloomberg, Mexico City retailer Grupo Gigante has offered $430 million for Office Depot Incorporated, 50% stake in their Mexican office supply joint venture. The purchase would give Gigante complete control of the Office Depot de Mexico and would con be conditioned on Gigante gaining rights to expand the chain into Latin America. Gigante and Office Depot will begin formal talks on the offer shortly. The offer was unsolicited and non-binding, and there's no assurance a transaction will be made. Staying with Capital Markets News, the Financial Times is reporting that shareholders were scrambling to salvage a $2.7 billion takeover bid by Maybank for Bank International, International Indonesia after Malaysia's central bank blocked the deal just as it was due to be finalized. The intervention is a blow for Indonesia, which has struggled to attract overseas money. Maybank agreed in March to pay $1.5 billion for a 55.7% stake in Bank Internationale Indonesia that is jointly owned by Temasek. Temasek, which is the Singapore State Investment Agency and South Korea's Kum Kim Bank. Maybank, Malaysia's largest lender, also made a $1.2 billion offer to buy the rest of the Indonesian bank. And in more capital markets news, according to Bloomberg News, BG Group may raise its $13.8 billion, billion Australian dollar bid for Origin Energy in September. Once the Australian target gets an alternative approach for its coal seam gas assets, the UK-based hostile bidder may also be delayed by two weeks from sending its formal bid document to Origin shareholders after after the Sydney-based company last week appealed to Australia's takeovers regulators about aspects of the offer. Origin may secure an alternative proposal for its coal seam gas business in September that investors can compare with BG's cash offer. Credit Suisse said in a report, Origin and Reading England-based BG are disputing the value of the Australian company's coal seam gas assets, which Origin, are, with, which Origin says are worth more than the UK's third biggest oil and gas producer is offering. Offering. And in other capital markets news, Reuters is reporting that British confectioner giant Cadbury is reviewing the future of its Australian beverage unit, which analysts say could be worth £600 million. Cadbury, which spun off its North American business, Dr. Pepper Snapple, in May, said the review of the unit would take months to complete. CEO Todd Stitzer said on Wednesday the business had around £300 million in annual revenues, or 6% of group sales. The decision followed a careful look through the group portfolio of businesses and that rounds out today's capital markets report thanks for joining us on emii.com for more details on these stories and much more click on to our capital markets channel online read the full stories and the latest developments